So I was just looking at my uh, Instagram comments and a, you should never do. No, they're all, they're so nice. And um, there was one man, one gentleman who was trying to hit on me, I guess, trying to explain to me uh, that I was his perfect woman, essentially. And to tell me that there was a there was a you know a few sentences before this of like that I fell from heaven, kind of like phrases you might have found on the internet. And the final phrase that he closed with was before a bunch of heart emojis, "You have been made to order." <laughs> that is true. You have been. So I think. Maybe he's not fully, you know, I think of that phrase generally as being for food, <laughs> you know, or perhaps clothing that is made to order. Good clothing, you know? Yeah, customized, so like not fast food. Food that you would, you know, that you that would be made for you, right? So I guess it's like a higher level of food, higher level of clothing. And so I received that compliment, you have been made to order and a bunch of hearts. I don't know why you've never told me that, Shane. That I had been made to order. I just assumed you knew that I customized you. <laughs> yeah, and made to I, your perfect order. I hit buy now. Yep, and there I was. Hello. Hello. Welcome to the show. Welcome to the show. Welcome to the show. It's time to talk about our lives. We've been in LA for four days. Mm-hmm. And we're venturing out of our Airbnb. For, for the, the first, first time. time. For something very critical. Hannah needs shoes. I forgot sneakers. She only has her boots. Yeah. Which are very wintry. My winter boots. Not great for 70 degrees. They were good for driving and snow and cold and stuff. I have walking sneakers. They're Birkenstocks. I have those. Which are good. But not for running. Because they're flat bottomed. You know? And like if I try to run in them. It's just like... <coughs> A clod hopper. Uh, not that I'm trying to like run a lot, but for walking Chloe longer distances, it's good to have like exercise shoes. So we're here at the Glendale Galleria, yep. something like that. It's like an outdoor mall thing. Yep. I have a qualm that I would like to raise with the city of Los Angeles. Thank you to Fracture for sponsoring this video. Fracture transforms your favorite photos into beautiful glowing glass prints of the highest quality shipped directly to your door. And they include everything that you need to hang it on a wall or set it up on a desk near a table. Hannah and I recently did a cute little photo shoot with our favorite photographers and friends, Studio 1252. And we got all these amazing photos that we just kind of like have on our phones now and so we wanted a way to display these beautiful photos rather than just looking at our phones. Fracture makes that very simple. You just select and upload your photos, choose from a variety of sizes and multi-photo layouts, and Fracture then prints your photos in vivid color directly onto glass. You can pick between original and matte finishes. We went with matte because we love the way that that looks. So whether you're turning your wall into a work of art, Fracture helps you brighten your space with moments that matter. Use our code SQUIRMYDRUBS22 to get 22% off your glass prints today. Link in the description, thank you Fracture. I have a qualm that I would like to raise with the city of Los Angeles. Pave your streets. I mean they're repave, paved. Repave. They're pa repave them. Mm. They are buckled. Like, it's as if you guys have earthquakes here. <laughs> no, but really, all the streets are so bumpy. Yeah. My head has been flying around, mm -hmm. even with my neck brace on. Yeah. For everyone that's about to say, wear your neck brace. Doesn't. Wearing my neck brace, my head's flying all around. <laughs> the roads are like driving on the moon. <laughs> They're cratered. It's true. And buckled and ravenous. Uh huh. And they're hurting me. And Shane's really Los upset Angeles. about it. Yeah. So far, it's my only qualm. Yeah. With this area. Everything else is great, thanks. I don't even mind the traffic. Yeah. Everyone was on there be like, oh, LA is known for their yeah. bad driving. I don't care about the traffic. I'd rather go slow over these bumpy, bumpy <laughs> roads. Yeah, I like when there's cars in front of us because when I'm, the, you know, when it's just us and like one car behind us, I get stressed. I would rather be 
bumper to bumper so I'm moving with everybody, you know? So, so for the 15 minute drive here, Hannah had my neck dripped yeah. in her right hand, yeah. driving with her left. LA, it's not safe. Come on. Pave, pave, pave. All right, and since everybody is really done with this conversation, I think we're gonna go. Being able to park and get out of the car in January and it's like warm and we're not freezing is so nice. Love it. This is amazing. All right, we might have gotten momentarily thrown off course by the food that we spotted, <laughs> but we're done now and we are gonna go find a shoe store. And I don't need new shoes because I got new shoes for Christmas. Thank you, Liz. I didn't do that. They go for it, man. See if they can make you jump higher. Just doing a little grocery shopping. Shane, what are we watching? We are watching the finale. Oh. Of Ordinary Joe, season one. Season one finale, we're about to start it. And no one is more excited than Chloe and her skanky legs. <laughs> what is that foot doing? She is asleep. That foot is up. No, she's watching <laughs> Ordinary Joe. She is excited. Huh? We are excited. I mean, I'm not really excited that it's over. I want more episodes, but... I'm excited to see the... Well, I know what happens, but... I know. I'm excited to see the live episode. I'm excited to see what happens. I hope for nothing more than a season two. Me too. For a great show. It's a good show. Yeah. It is a phenomenal show. Am I biased because... Yep. I'm involved? You yeah. are, 100%. But I'm also objective. Yeah, true. I'm 100%. TV... <laughs> Connoisseur. Oh, yeah? I love it. I think it should really uh, have a second season. It's wonderful for disability and... And just as a show. And love. And love. And love. It's a great show. All right, I'm getting impatient, so let's begin. Look, it's a deal breaker. Right? No chance.